YouTubes, I got this call yesterday. Hey, the ice maker is not making ice. Can you come check it out? I'm like, yeah, I'll check it out in the morning, tomorrow morning. I had worked all day and I just got home. And then she's like, well, I tried to clean the machine and now it doesn't make ice. I'm like, oh, you, I'm all, you tried to clean it? I go, did you take things apart? Well, maybe a couple things, um, but I put them all back. And, but now it's just, it's not making ice. I'm <laughs> like, all right, I'll come over and check it out. So we're on our way there. I'm bringing you guys along. And uh, we'll get out here and we'll check it out. I think the one, I think the one super old time homeless guy that always had the fuck the Dodger signs, I think homeboy passed away. That was his camp right there. And I think he's gone, dude. I think I think that old he was an old time Santa Cruz homeless guy. And he always had these signs out there, fuck the Dodgers or fuck the Rams. And he, oh he also used to have like the fuck Trump sign out there. Um <laughs> and uh dude it was a long, cold, wet winter here for here. And I think I think it just took homeboy out, but I think I think that guy passed away, so he's gone. So I always like seeing the F the Dodger signs. That was classic. But anyways, let's uh let's get out here and see what we're getting into. Tippins. Let's see how you make out today. Man, yeah, not too bad. Ice maker, yeah, we'll be on the ground. Get some knee pros going. And we'll get some rubber glovers. And then we'll get in there. Push a socky. Let me move this out of the way. A little defrosting going on. Okay. Yeah, they're at the end of the ice. Let's see, the sump looks like it's in. It looks like it's on there. Oh, the drain light's pinched back there. I can see. I can see where that's got a little pinchy in it. Oh yeah, look, the sump in the back's not hooked up. Can you see that? I can see where it's kind of hanging, so I think we might have to take it apart. That hose shouldn't be pinched. And then what's going on with this? That's a drain. That looks. Yeah, see that's not hanging right. Something's something's not connected right right there in the back. Uh, let's see how I uh, let's see how we make out with that. I want to take the top off. I think this top comes off. Dent right there, plugs. Oh yeah, we got some good old duct tape here. Sounds good, sounds good. Another use for the duct tape. All right, here we go. We're getting somewhere. Yes, I think we need to clean this thing. Looky there, look at that water tube. Oh, and the rear curtain looks a little funk. Funkadelic. Let's see here. Might as well just start from scratch. Yeah, look at that. That needs a little TLC. We'll get the front one. We got the water tube on these comes apart like this. And then it's just, you got the one little retainer right there. Look at that. We can get that cleaned up. And then it's the usual suspects right here on the evap. Check for evap separation, it's good. That's the water fill tube. And that's the back piece. And uh, yeah, we 
could do some scrubbing. Sometimes it'll clean up. They'll clean up real good like this. You just gotta get in there and scrub it till it's all nice and tidy. stubborn little area right here. Getting, getting there. We're on our way. We've got it all shined up. But what I gotta do, too, is I gotta get this cleaned up. And then I gotta find out why that sump isn't connected in the back. I gotta get that sump connected in the back. And I think that's their biggest problem. The water's probably just going down the drain. And it looks like it unclips from the front. Right here, see that? Yep, okay. Then that drops down. And I'd like to see. Yeah, see, it's got the standard Hoshisaki float switch in the back back there. It looks like it's kind of off kilter a bit. And there's the bin switch. It's got to come out and get all cleaned up, see? It's all dirty too. Can you see that? And then there's a, the Hoshisaki float. Looks like it's cocked. Looks like it's cacked. Man, I think I gotta take this plate off right here. And I can see right down in there. So I think it's a couple Phillips screws right there and then a couple in the back. Let's do that and we'll take a look at it. She's got the Captain Kacker on her. Yeah, that looks kind of 
funky. Like it's just kind of sitting there. Huh. I don't know if that's broken or if it just sits in there like that. Oh, this clips, so this is gonna clip onto the back of the sump. See that? It's clean in there. So it looks like it goes down in the hole and then the back side of that float is going to clip on to the sump. That's what it looks like to me. Yep, it's going to come down like that. And then the back end of that float should clip on to the back end of that sump. There's no kink in the hose now back there. We're gonna fill up with water and then go into the freeze cycle, hopefully. And I'm gonna get the air filter. I'll take it over to the sink and wash it up too. And it looks like maybe they took it apart and just didn't get it back together right, but it still needed a lot more cleaning. So, let's see how it does. Let's see if it'll, it's right now it's filling with water and we'll see if it goes into a free cycle and how it does. All right, if you look on the sides here, the ice cubes are forming. Let's see if we can take a little peeky peeky. Yep, she's making ice. Now we just gotta let her make ice and get to the point of defrost or harvest. I always call it defrost, but it, the correct terminology is harvest. So it's looking, it's looking promising here. Yeah, this thing's all falling apart. Look at these are these two clips have to go under here on this front piece. See that? Let's see if I can fix that too. Looks like that ice guide is off kilter. That, I gotta fix that. See that? So they when she took it apart, it's funny. Um, I didn't look at that before, but that ice guide's not back in right. See how the ice is sticking? I think we're gonna have to fix that. Yeah, that's no fly zone. Sticking on both sides. So this is not incorrectly, this is fucked up. fix that. We'll let it finish its harvest. Yeah, we'll get that fixed up. We should be in good shape. Yep. Well, that was a good catch right there. what's going on with this thing. Yeah, this thing's all hooky lao. Hooky dookie lao. That used to go there. You can see where it broke. So it gotten taken out one time and it broke. So it looks like it goes like that. And that would get it back together. I think they need to ride up on top of those clips like that. So it's kind of important how it goes. And then see that's gonna to be too short on that side. It's gotta go this way, one set of pins. I think it goes like this. I think that goes up like that. That one goes like that. Uh -huh. And then this one's going to go like this. And then that's how it rides. That's the rider right there. Now it's going to work. Let me get this all back together and we'll take another look. 
so yeah it looks like they probably they just took everything apart and then um didn't get it back together um it probably got back together if this was still one piece this had broken off at one point so i probably should order them up a new new ice guide and then other than that i think we're gonna make ice i think we're gonna be okay and the sump was hanging down like that and the water was probably all draining out um there's just little tricks to putting this stuff back together it's plastic it's modular it could be a pain in the butt um well let's let's let it make one more batch and then we'll double check that it comes off freely because it was sticking in there before because this wasn't put it back right and i didn't check i didn't check the ice guide but now it's it looks it looks like it's supposed to be so i know the machine makes ice now i just gotta we'll watch it one more batch here we go basket ball <laughs> yeah yeah baby Hold up the water we're in the freeze mode we're gonna watch it make a batch of ice the water's not draining down the drain let's see if we can if we can do it I kind of see the edge of the evap right there starting to form some ice and we'll let it do its thing here and we'll, we'll check it So we dropped the whole batch. Nothing stuck on the grid. So this dude is a wrap. She's fixed up. We're back to making ice. Not too shabby.